Hey guys, this is Pharaoh 2091 and welcome back to Let's Play Apollo Justice Ace Attorney. Last time we left off, we started the trial once again for this case, and well, it turns out that the witness we have called up uh, right now is Alita, freaking Walkie's fiance. So it's like, what? She's testifying against him? And as we were talking to her, she seemed like she just switched, like a freaking like light switch. It's like a totally different person now. And now she's like, she wasn't denying that she went to the clinic, but now she told us, well, I went there to warn him. Well, let's uh, go ahead and do this cross-examination. So she says, oh, I went there to warn him, blah, blah, blah. Well, and she didn't want to, she's like, why, why, else had, why, why, why else would she go, you know? And she's not hiding any dark secrets. Really now, you're not hiding any secrets. Okay, wait a minute now. What about this chart? You were clearly hiding that you, you used to work there before. You never told us that until we told you now. You never brought it up before. It's like, who cares? I mean, it, should, it shouldn't matter if you brought it up before, right? So obviously you are hiding something. This chart was found inside a safe in the doctor's office. Yes? Why would this one chart be in that safe? Alita, you know why it was, don't, don't you? Mind filling me in? Dr. Marectus didn't have the leisure of making mistakes. That's why he wrote up a false report and kept the truth locked away. Bad, er, doctor. And this is where you come in, Alita. The nurse who filled this report, filled this chart was you. Which means you knew about Waki's failed operation. Interesting. You were in the same position as Dr. Maractus. Kind of makes it hard to claim a no connection, doesn't it? Very. You're bold for a novice, I'll give you that. Don't call me a novice. Mr. Justice, you must know I was only a nurse. The doctor is responsible for the chart's contents. Now, mm, is that true? Yeah, whatever. Hmm, this chart business seems to be quite important. Please amend your testimony accordingly. Too bad, little attorney. Oh, wait a minute. What the hell's that? Do, do we get to perce perceive more? Seems like we do. My bracelet's reacting again. What is it, Apollo? I felt my bracelet vibrate just now. Your bracelet? Just like yesterday. Like you said. So, yep. The nervous habit gives him away. But I can't see anything, Apollo. Eh? Then what's my bracelet reacting to? Wait, maybe? Yes, that has to be it! What has to be it? Your senses, Apollo. They must be sharper than mine! Huh? I can't see it, but you can sense it! I don't know about that, Trucy. I don't have some kind of special power or anything. Listen to me, Apollo. There's a weak point somewhere in Alita's testimony, but we don't know what her nervous habit is. Well, then what do we do? You have to perceive it yourself, Apollo, with your eyes and your senses. And it's up to me and my bracelet. I don't know why, but the bracelet helps. Somehow touching it helps me focus. Let's give it a shot and bring down that testimony. Okay, so... Eh... Mm. Well, okay, I, I want to go on this testimony because... On this statement, because it seems like that's where I reacted to, so let me go ahead and uh, crap, didn't mean to do that. Uh, okay, well, you're sitting there on your chart, so what does that have to do with this case? If there was something in that chart to make me look bad, I would have dealt with it. The only one responsible, responsible for that chart is the presiding doctor, Dr. Maractus. She's hiding something, I can smell it, and I bet she's got a habit that gives it away. I just have to focus to find her nervous habit. Maybe it's time to give my bracelet a rub. Yes, yes, I meant to do that, but I pressed the wrong button. So let me go back. There we go. Now, why would I... Let's see... What's her habit? Oh, oh! Wait a minute. Okay, you see that just now? Her ring was moving when she said go to the clinic. 
Okay, we, we'll, we'll try that again. Let's see if we're right. So see, nothing's, nothing's wrong there. But as soon as she says, go to the clinic now, there you go. She's fidgeting with her damn ring. So let's confirm that. Oh, yeah. I, this, I like this gameplay. Why go to the clinic for a half-year-old chart now, you ask? But you know why you would go now, don't you? I don't know what you're talking about. It was quite clear, Alita. You have a nervous habit. The moment you said the word now, you used your right thumb to fiddle with your ring. What? She was unsure. I saw it. Now. That's the key word. The chart wasn't part of your past. It was a clear and present threat. That's ridiculous. What if that were the case? I would have I would have had six months to do something about it. Indeed. Eh? Which means something happened quite recently. Something to make that chart a problem for you now. I've got her on the ropes now. I can feel it. Time to strike the killing blow. With evidence! Alita, there's no use trying to hide it. The chart became a threat to you now. Because of this. And... Hmm. Why would they have become a... Uh, hold on a minute. Hmm. Actually, I'm not really sure why it would be... Uh, hmm. Chart. Would it be the chart? No, the, the chart became a threat because of this. Um, I think, yeah, I think it was a checkup report. I would assume so anyway. I hope I'm right. A health checkup report belonging to the defendant. The Katagis are trying to get out of the business. The health checkup this month was their first ever. What did you think when you heard about this? Uh, oh, nothing. Why should I think anything? Oh, I would think you were posi positively beside yourself because you were afraid. You knew what Walkie's chest x-ray would reveal. <laughs> A full half year had passed since operation. You thought you were home free. When a chart came back came back to haunt you. Ah! Oh yeah, there we go. There we go. I think we do got her on the ropes now. Did she just hold that pose all that time? Jeez. That's all, Your Honor. What what just happened? Did the witness just admit to lying? I sensed it. There was a great aura emanating from Air Forehead. He sensed it too? Very cool. So the lady was lying, it seems. That's correct. She said she had no connection to the Miraculous Clinic, but her connection was deep indeed. A bit too deep. If the Kataki's got a hold of this chart with her name, she'd be finished. Is that right, Alita? You guessed it. Oh, wow, she is. Okay, she's, she's making this kind of easy for us. Order! Order! I did it! I broke her testimony! Amazing, Apollo! I didn't see it at all! Daddy was right about you! Wait! Uh-oh. Okay, I guess we're not done. Oh, Alita? It's true. That chart was bad news for me. That's why I went to meet that doctor that day. Went to meet the doctor that day. But that's all! I told him about Waki and went home. It appears this cross examination is far from over. What? She hid the truth from us, that is clear, yet it is not clear that this truth has anything to do with that case of the case in hand. Hmm. Very well. The witness will add this to her testimony. And we'll have a bit more cross-examination. Ugh! I was so close! You're so close! Keep at her, Apollo! Okay, um... Let's see... Nothing happened at all. I warned him and left. Now... No... Okay, if nothing happened... Explain this! I, I don't get it. It was fine inside the, the safe. And, well, when the hell did that happen? 
nothing, I mean, something obviously happened at that clinic. That's why it looked like there was a burglar in there. It looks like they were trying to open the safe. Stuff was all over the place, all over the floor. And there was a bullet in the safe. Something happened. I think that bullet proves it. You say nothing happened in the doctor's office. I disagree. Take a look at this. What's that? It looks like a squished up ball of clay. Kind of like you, actually. This bullet was found in the Miraculous Clinic office. Something did happen in that office, Alita. Enough of this joking around. The police investigated that clinic. Ah, but this was struck, stuck inside the doctor's safe. Inside the safe? Oh, look, I think it's the first time, uh, Clavier, or Clavier, whatever. His, I can never say his full name, his first name, but right. Um, he's sweating now, so it's like, ah, okay. I guess the police didn't check that far. But there is a problem. How can you say that bullet was fired on that day? Weren't you the one who explained rifling marks to us? Ah, uh, bit him right in the butt. The pistol was taken from the Kentucky Mansion that day. If the marks on this bullet matched the murder weapon, then this proves a firearm was discharged in that office on the day of the murder. Not bad, Air Forehead. Bailiff! Have this bullet analyzed immediately! Okay. Thirty minutes later, a report arrives. The rifling marks on both bullets are identical. Who the hell was going to say that? The bailiff? I don't know. I, I was, I was going to be an announcer, like, you know, you know when movies are like, you know, one year later, and then something happens? I thought that's what was happening there. Well, it seems as though a bullet in the safe was fired from the murder weapon. Perhaps the defense would like to state their position? The bullet in that safe proves one fact. A pistol was fired in that office on that day, and at the time of the firing, the safe was open. The safe which contained a top-secret chart. Do you think someone was threatening Dr. Maractus in order to open the safe? Only one person was in a position to do such a thing. Our witness, Alita! Seems like it. Order! 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 Mr. Justice, where, why, where are you going with this? Are you accusing the witness? Alita knew about Waki Kataki's botched operation. She got engaged in him without telling him about it. As long as that bullet remained in his chest, his days were numbered. What if she married him and then the bullet finally reached his destination? What? That reminds me. Apparently the Katakis have been asserting themselves in lawful business practices. They're making quite a great deal of money. A fortune, if you will. Nefarious! So she planned to marry him just to get her hands on his fortune? Wait, who said objection? Uh, you said it? You keep talking trash about my Alita, and I'm sue you, lawyer man! Uh, huh? Me? Yeah, you said... You said you, you'd... You'd... You'd abuse my Alita! Um, I think you mean accuse. Same difference! Well, you can't have her, she's mine! It was me! I shot that doctor! Me! He left me to die, so I left him to die too! There in that park! Wucky! Just cool down a second! You keep your hands off of my leader, or I'll... <laughs> Alita? Oh, I'm sorry, I, I just... It's been so long since I laughed so hard! Something funny? Waki, wake up and smell reality. Uh, Alita, baby? The signature on the chart? The engagement? I mean, come on! It's so obvious! Even for a brainless, spoiled brat such as yourself. Alita! Your honesty is like a breath of foul air, Fraulein. Hey, I wasn't getting out of this clean anyway. So... The family fortune is what you're really after. That's right. I wanted the money. No way! That's whack! I ain't trying to hear that! Should have done the wedding earlier. Oh well. By the way, can I ask you a question? Well, who, me? I believe you said you were going to abuse me? Accuse. 
Oh, of what crime might I ask? Huh? Oh, I'm a bad girl, sure. I got close to that brat because I wanted his money. But he was the one with a pistol. He could have fired it into the safe and I and after I had already left the clinic. What? I would never do such a thing like that. It was definitely that silly brat. Wait, but what are you talking about, Trucy? You had the most to lose if that chart was found. But I didn't have a pistol now, did I? Well, you could have taken walkies. You think he'd have mentioned that, no? All I've heard him say is, it was me, I shot him. Objection! That's only because he's trying to protect you. Sorry to intrude in this lovely conversation. But the two of you are forgetting one criminal critical point. What? What point? Certainly the fraud line wanted that chart. You assume she flattened the doctor into opening that safe, but then... Wouldn't she have taken the chart? Oh! You see? That chart wouldn't have been left in that safe. Duh! He... He's right! Alita? Yes? It is clear to this court that you are not a very good fiancé. Oh, I'm flattered. Perhaps it's time you told us the truth? Tell us about yourself, including your actions and whereabouts on that day. Don't forget! We're proving that you were at the Miraculous Clinic on the day of the crime! Yeah, you better not lie to us anymore, you... woman. Don't, don't make me call you a devil, woman! And actually, no, that was reserved for... Uh, Dahlia. I mean, she really... She really was a devil woman, my god. I don't think anyone could be as bad as her. Or can there be someone else? Oh, who knows? But uh, any case, uh, in any case, yeah, we'll hear this testimony next time, guys. So, as usual, thank you all for watching, and I'll see you guys next time for Let's Play Apollo Justice, Ace Attorney. I'll see you guys later.